Hi, I'm Jason Nelson. Welcome you to another Friday Fit Tip. In this episode, we're gonna smash a little controversy about the deadlift. To deadlift or not to deadlift? Let's see what we come up with. Talk to you. All right, so in the deadlift can be one of the most beneficial exercises to the human body. It also could be one of the more dangerous exercises if performed improperly. Now, when we when we speak about deadlifting or people have the idea of deadlifting, the thing about heaving massive amounts of weight from the floor and dropping it and screaming and, and banging around and using smelling salts and ammonia and all that other stuff. The deadlift is one of the oldest uh, um, known human patterns. Remember, we evolved from here, correct? So we started eating as a species from the floor up. So the oldest human pattern would be bent over pulling. We weren't looking for the trees for food. We were looking to the floor. So the so with a traditional deadlift, not a Romanian deadlift or a single leg deadlift, we're gonna go traditional. Here's how you start, here's how you get moving quickly and safely. Um, bar goes this way. One. You I'm gonna change the angle a little bit here so you can see me better. Get your shins close to the bar. Squat. That space that the bar is away from the shin, that's your starting position. So look at that again. Okay, I'm getting close to the bar. I'm gonna squat and move the bar six. The bar is about six inches away from my shin. I'm gonna squat down now and grip that bar. Now I'm gonna use an alternating grip. Why? Because you wanna put four fingers on one side this way and four fingers that way. Your dominant hand would be pronated. Um, I'm left handed, so it's gonna be this hand. If you're right handed, it'll be the other way around. You grip your bar, you keep your chest tall, right? You press through the heels and your, your chest, the line of your chest is way in front of the knee. So basically, your armpits are around over the bar or slightly in front. Your eye gaze is straight ahead, your chest is tall, your line of sight is in line with your shoulders, you press through the heels, squeeze your shoulder blades, fire the core, and pull. Boom, down, top, pull, boom, back down. That's how you safely pick your load up. Now I can, uh, next video I'll go through and show different variations of the deadlift, but remember, the deadlift can be a friend and it can be a fool. You decide what you want it to be. Again, it's contraindicated if you have these issues, but if you want to prevent these issues and any uh, um, muscle spasms or muscle strains to the lower back, You've got to strengthen it. You cannot avoid not strengthening your lower back. No, there are other exercises you can do, but bent over pulling, you are going to use in your daily life. You bend over and pull all the time. Just think about it. How many times you pick your kids up from the floor, how many times you go to the supermarket, you are going to bend, bend over and pull something. So, this is Jay Nelson. I'll talk to you soon. Leave your comments at the bottom of the video. You got my email address. Shoot me an email, chop it up. I have tons of videos where I can show you this technique. If you want me to get into a more detailed video next time, we definitely could do it. This is Jay Nelson. Now is your Friday Fit Tip. Talk to you soon.